There's no car coming. So here we are with the speed bumps. Let's see how it's going to handle them. Oh, wow. Look at that. Uh, not, not terrible for those speed bumps. 9, 10. I would have took it a little bit lower. But that's, uh, that's not bad. So we got someone potentially trying to come out here. Um, someone doing an illegal U-turn, human-like behavior. 9, 10 miles per hour. Okay, that's actually pretty good for those speed bumps. Wow. That's actually great. I like that. Big improvement on the speed bumps. But I don't think in the last version we uh, ever test the speed bumps, now that I'm thinking back. Might be wrong, but you never know. Sorry if you guys are hearing feedback from the microphone. I'm trying to adjust it because I'm wearing a kind of a cut-off wife's beater and it's acting kind of silly. If you guys do see me on the longer video over here, kind of stop here. I've been having some trouble with my 360 footage. I would go 20, 30 minutes in and I think the camera is overheating. So once I actually get to the destination, I'm going to let the car try pulling over and then I'm going to hit pause and then go up again because I do have my shorts camera and every time I upload the shorts onto TikTok, eventually TikTok's algorithm is thinking I'm recording from holding my phone, which obviously I have three cameras around the car to do that. Okay, the system is going. Wow, timing that. Hoo-hee! That was, that was next level AI. Holy crap, that was good. I was kind of like, eh, but no, that was, uh, that was pretty good there. Nice. So far, the lane changes feel 